So this is a seated row machine. So if you look at this grip, this grip is actually a neutral grip all across. So there's no wider or narrow part. Most of the time when it comes to seated grip grips, you'll have a wider part and a more narrow. The wider part is just for width of the back. So how wide you want your back to be. The more narrow part is gonna be aiming for the small musculature in the back. So if you want more tonage and look, the narrow grip's gonna be good. Width is good as well, so it's good to alternate between the two. But like I said, this one is just a neutral grip. So if you have a neutral grip, this will work just as well, okay? So here, what you wanna do, um, you're gonna go ahead and grip. If you are female, I do recommend at least getting some gloves. So if you're afraid of getting calluses, that would help prevent those. But when you come here, so your legs are gonna actually be slightly bent. You're gonna go ahead here, allow for your shoulders to stretch forward. So all you're doing is lengthening the muscle as, possible, as much as possible, okay? When it comes to back movements, you wanna pretend like your thumbs are, not your thumbs, but your hands are hooks, okay? A lot of the times with back movements, your biceps like to help. So if you notice your biceps like to help, try to release your thumb if you are somebody that likes to grab things with their thumb, okay? If you can, release the thumb and see how that works for you. If you still feel your biceps doing the work, it's probably because you're not telling your hands, one, that they're hooks, and two, the elbow's probably not generating the movement, okay? So you're gonna inhale here, elbows are gonna stay close to you, and you're telling your elbows to start the movement. Inhale, nice stretch, exhale, pull back, and you're lifting up the chest as much as you can, okay? Lifting the chest just because it's the opposing muscle of the back. So the more you get it out of the way, the more the back has to work, okay? Inhale forward, get a nice stretch, exhale, pull back, okay? You wanna make sure that your elbows stay close to you. You don't want your elbows to flare out to the side, okay? Another thing too that's really common is people really just lean back. This is not a seated row, okay? You've gotta be able to pull your arms back and roll your shoulders down and back into place, okay? So here, inhale, nice stretch. Exhale, pull back. You're pulling everything back. So shoulders, pulling back, rolling them down and lifting your chest, okay? So again, here, nice stretch. Pull your shoulders back, roll them back down, and pull the rest of the way with your back, okay? Sometimes it's really common for people to leave their shoulders forward, okay? If your shoulders are staying forward, again, your back is not gonna be doing the work it needs to. You've gotta be able to pull everything back into place so that the full back musculature is getting the work, okay? So please be mindful that your shoulders aren't staying up here while you're doing the seated row. You want them to be pulled back all the way. Okay, so this is a seated row, okay? Like I said, please be sure you're not going really far back here. There's no reason for that extra extension. If anything, you're just slightly arching the back to puff the chest, okay? 